Hi friends, good evening and again welcome to my channel Mugambiga Nursing. Friends here we are discussing questions for CHO, NHM, JPHN and also we are discussing questions for insurance medical service exam, RRB and ESI coming exams. Let's see the questions. First question, in healthcare delivery system, grassroots level workers include options option a anganwadi workers option b asha workers option c village health guide option d all of this question grassroots level workers in health care delivery system correct answer is option d all of this that is anganwadi workers asha workers village health guide all are part of Grassroot workers in healthcare delivery system. And the next question Population covered by an Anganwadi workers is options option A 2000, option B 3000, option C 1500, and option D 1000. One Anganwadi workers is for 1000 population. Option D is the correct answer. The next question, ASHA workers are functioning at options, option A community level, option B village level, option C PHC level, option D district level. Full form of ASHA is accredited social health activist. Okay. Here our question, ASHA workers are functioning at which level? That is the question. So ASHA worker, correct answer is at village level option b is the correct answer asha workers are community health workers they are the part of nrhm national health mission functioning at village level the next question which of the following health service is not available in rural health unit Options. Option A. Maternal and child health work. Option B. Communicable disease control work. Option C. Environmental sanitation work. Option D. Cancer treatment facility. Which service is not available in rural health unit? Which one is the not a function of rural health unit? Correct answer. Option D. Cancer treatment facility, remaining maternal and child health work, communicable disease control work, environmental sanitation work, all are the part of rural health unit. Question, the multipurpose workers in a general services, a rural population of option A, 500, option B, 1000, option C, 3000, option D, 5000. A multipurpose workers for a general service in rural population covers 500 population okay a multi one multi-purpose workers for 5000 population next question which one of the following is not a function of sub center options option a maternal and child health option b referral option c national health programs option d training question which is not coming under sub center function Okay, correct answer is training. Training is not a function of sub-center. Option D is the correct answer. Move on to the next question. Rubella is caused by options. Option A, orthomyxovirus. Option B, paramyxovirus. Option C, toga virus. Option D, arbovirus. Rubella is also known as German measles. It is one of the acute childhood infections usually caused by RNA virus family. RNA virus of Toga family. So answer will come Toga virus. Okay. And the incubation period is 2 to 3 weeks. Usually 18 days. One attack of Rubella means lifelong immunity second attack is very rare so here our question rubella is caused by which organism that is the question so rna virus of toga family option c is the correct answer 
And the next question, administration of which one of the following vaccine can cause paralysis in children? Options, option A, measles vaccine, option B, Sabin, polio vaccine, option D, DPT vaccine, option D, DT vaccine. Which vaccine cause paralysis in children? Correct answer is option B, Sabin, polio vaccine. Sabin polio vaccine is oral polio vaccine. It is given at birth that is zero dose at birth. First dose at 6 week, second dose at 10th week, third dose at 14th week. Booster dose at 16 to 24th month. Sabin polio vaccine is an oral polio vaccine. The next question, Hansen's disease is also known as options. Option A, tetanus. Option B, leprosy. Option C, rubella. Option D, measles. Hansen's disease is also known as leprosy. Option B is the correct answer. Leprosy is a chronic infectious disease caused by mycobacterium leprae. It affects mainly the peripheral nerves. Okay, leprosy affect the peripheral nerves. It also affect the skin, muscles, eyes, bones, testes and internal organs. The average incubation period of leprosy is about 3 to 5 years. And the next question, white plague is also known as Options, option A, plague, option B, Kalazar, option B, TB, option D, chicken pox. White plague is also known as, option C, it is TB. TB or tuberculosis. Tuberculosis is also known as barometer of social welfare. And also it is known as white plague. The next question, HIV virus was discovered in the year. Options, option A, 1981, option B, 1983, option C, 1985 and option D, 1991. HIV virus was discovered in the year 1983. Option B is the correct answer. The next question, which of the following is a live vaccine? Options, option A, SAC polio vaccine. Option B, hepatitis B vaccine. Option D, 17 D vaccine. Option D, all of this. Live vaccines include BCG, typhoid oral vaccine, oral polio vaccine, yellow fever vaccine, measles vaccine, rubella, mumps, influence, epidemic typhus, all a live vaccine. Here, which of the following vaccine is a live vaccine? So, yellow fever vaccine is coming under live vaccine. A yellow fever vaccine is 17D vaccine. Option C is the correct answer. Remaining options that is SAC vaccine. SAC vaccine is killed vaccine. Also, hepatitis B vaccine is killed vaccine. Rabies vaccine is killed vaccine. Typhoid vaccine, cholera vaccine, pertussis vaccine and uh, Japanese encephalitis vaccine all are, are killed vaccines. And the next question, World Tuberculosis Day is celebrated in options. Option A, March 24, option B, May 24, option C, April 24, option D, June 24. World Tuberculosis Day is celebrated in March 24, option A is the correct answer. And the next question, the first bone of the vertebral column is options, option A, atlas, option B, axis, option C, clavicle, option D, hyoid, which is the first bone in the vertebral column. It is atlas, option A is the correct answer. Second bone in the vertebral column is axis, first bone is atlas and second bone is axis. And the next question Silent killer in neonates. Options. Option A. Respiratory distress. Option B. Hypothermia. Option D. Hyperthermia. And option D. All of this. Which disease is known as silent killer in neonate? It is hypothermia. Same silent killer in adult is hypertension. And the next question and the last question. Blue death disease is option, option A diabetes, option B plague, option C cholera, option D diphtheria. Which disease is also known as blue death? It is cholera. Option C is the correct answer. 
here we discuss some of the important and previous year questions for CHO, NHM and JPHN exam preparation. Surely these questions will guide you for your studies. Thank you for watching my questions. If it is useful for your studies, please share to your friend circle and also subscribe my channel.